cheesecake. So yeah, anyways, we've got a whole bunch of crumbs. We're now back to Northern Mountains. Trunks is 29, obviously needs to level up, and unfortunately, oh my god, oh my, oh my gentle Jesus, where the crap are the pink snakes going? Yeah, they're gone. They're gone. You're not likely to see them ever again. But yeah, so now you now have blue snakes, to, you now got blue snakes to deal with. Which are annoying beyond recognition. But there's a few areas that we've got to get that we're going to be running past that are near water, so we might be able to grind fish. Not so, uh, so much grind fish, I'm just going to hope that I get lucky and get at least a fish. Fish. Anyway, oh, keep pushing. Knock these pricks out of the way. This, like, particular segment is probably just going to consist of just random sort of stuff and grinding up to do other grinding up to do things in the in in the near future. Now let's see. We're up here. Save stating. for the, actually I'm pretty sure you can, just going to go on like this, we just do that, speed it up, keep tapping the shit out of the buttons, alright so he's at 30, um, I'm happy with that, ah, 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 fucking, where the hell did you come from god damn it, Beat the shit out of you. I'm smaller, but I'm more potent. Beat the shit out of you too. Come on. Chop them up. Alright, cool beans. I don't know why I keep saying cool beans all the time. Cool beans. Cool beans. Okay, I'll shut up. Anyways, now the place is surrounded by these sort of... By these fucking things, which are annoying the shit out of me. Oh, it's a good thing I did grind up to 30, because I needed to be 30. So we're now in here. Plans for the designs of the androids. That's pretty much the weakness. Krillin shows up. We go in here. And this is where the other cell is hiding. So yeah, that's gone. That cell is nothing to worry about and that is the master computer that masterminded the programming of cell and whether or not whether whether it was canonical or not the programming of androids 13 14 and 15 guess what we get to do with it we get to blow it up good times oh crap maybe not good times It's gonna blow, and it's gone. So apparently Goku is now feeling better. Probably the greatest thing to happen in this. Probably now, this is probably now the greatest thing to happen in this segment. Gets me thinking that this sec that this game is actually probably gonna end pretty quickly. I mean, this is the ninth segment we're in now, and we're up to the and we've just unleashed Cell. It's not gonna be very, yeah. It's not going to be very long before we get to the battle against the androids and Cell goes into a second form and then after that we're going to end up having to bloody... We're going to end up fighting Cell, letting him transform to his third form and then it's not very... it's not too far. I'd be surprised if this playthrough hit 20 segments. Pretty much. And... oh hi. Yay! The greatest... The world's greatest heroes make his triumphant return. All right, pretty much. Yeah, they are. 
Kame color. <laughs> yeah, nah, he's... It's, yeah, it's pretty strange, boy. The next level, he's ascending. When did Vegeta say he was ascending? Or at least, when did he say that in earshot of me or Piccolo or anything like that? Seriously. Exactly. Hyperbolic time chamber. Pretty much. Uh, it could be in Lovey Dovey Goku for Christ's sake. Yeah, Goku's off to grab Vegeta because Vegeta might be interested in getting a shitload of training in, his, in a speedy number of, amount of time. So we now have Trunks to deal with. Um, so what's our next job? Uh, our next task is, would be to go to Kami's Lookout. Um, is there even anything else we... Oh, whoops. Is there even anything else we can do? Um... No, I don't really think there is. I mean, I could probably go, um... I could probably go hunting for stuff. Actually, first thing I'll do... I'll check to see if I can get Vegeta, because if I can get Vegeta... I'll see if I can grind him up a little bit. No, I can't. So, so I guess it's more, so I guess it's more plot, so I guess it's more story buddy, following the story and shit. Yeah, off we go. Alright, so we're now up here. We're up here, we're down here. And so now we got this. Only two of us can train in the Hyper Block Time Chamber at once. It's, fa it's a, it's a father-son pairing, pretty much. Paired food, birth, birth, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Hypo should really assimilate him. So there you go. Pretty much. Okay, so Trunks and Vegeta are temporarily out of the mix. So and so too are Gohan and Goku. And so too is Gohan. Well, we haven't unlocked Goku yet, of course. So we're basically stuck having to fight Android 17, and hopefully this doesn't take too long because I prefer that it didn't take too long. to Roshi's Island. Save state. Do a different slot just just in case. And here they are. Not here. Possibly. Precisely. And that yeah that's just gonna be right there only for the sole purpose of you getting onto it and flying over to another to a different island. Now, to be honest, actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut here and then I'm going to cut back once my energy bar is fully charged. Charging complete. And we're off. And it disappears. We've used it, but so it's, dis so it's gone. Probably one of the best songs in here. I'd rather listen to it without having to speak. Start things off, scanning 17, and while we're at it, we can scan 16 as well since he's still up here. Oh yes, it's also worth pointing out that Piccolo actually recovers his HP when he's in this form. Which I think is a pretty nice little tidbit. And once again, I failed to go looking for Senzu beans and fish. Fish. Fish and kicks. 
probably the weirdest name for a Yu-Gi-Oh card I think I've ever seen. I cannot see where the fuck this, this idiot is. And great, there goes my Supernamic Transformation. Whoopsie. And there goes that. Flesh and bone, not perfect, destroy it before it happens. Yes, it will. And we all go crack. Once again, that just that is just there for the sole purpose of you using it once, and that's it. So we're now getting nice little chunks of energy. I it's a good thing I'm getting energy and not health from these rocks because I'm better off getting the energy because I'm just going to end up healing anyway when I transform into super damage. So we've got all the energy back, so let's go and knock this prick out. Oi, quit being a noob. Oi, crap. I have to shut the door here because we're out of time from, turf, from this turf lane job. Crap. Holy crap, he was just stuck there. Seriously, he was just stuck there. Thank you for that glitch, it just made it a piece of cake. Yeah. Shouldn't you be, actually, shouldn't you be detecting three powers because there's nail in there as well? So, yeah. Oh, crap. You know what, I, w I really wish that glitch was still happening, just so I can knock this thing over quickly. Because I've got more bloody plot points to deal with after this. Alright, so there goes that energy. So I pretty much have to hope that he doesn't pull off a comeback and kill me. Because I'm not save, because I'm not save stating any, because I didn't save state anywhere during the fight. Because that would just be that would that would be a bit more blatant in the cheating department. But doesn't matter. The battle's been won anyways. And look who shows up. Yeah, hell's no. Clearly not. Agingly efficient, eighteen. Poetry in motion. <sighs> just, ra just random sort of stuff. He's got no idea who the hell he's dealing with. And guess what? Yeah, pretty much. Piss off! Get the hell out of there! Get going! Three. I thought a puzzle was supposed to be like five pieces, kind of like Exodia. Nice offer, but no thanks. Why is this thing's a little crowded in there already? Just a second. Just shut the door so that I didn't get interrupted. Best to run. Yes, of course. Why don't you butter off? No, you won't. It does absolutely nothing. Oh, for fuck's sake. I closed the door to make sure I didn't get interrupted, and I get interrupted! Maybe he gets the bloody message from that. Yeah, he's... I'm just gonna ignore him. Because... I'm lucky enough to have... Not one, but two doors that can lock. So... Yeah, TN just shows up. He's, he's, he's a floater. And absorption time. Like Meowth says. Suck him up! Cell now enters his second form. And I think it's now seriously, I think it now seriously has just hit me how short this playthrough is going to be. Not really a huge problem since I already have my next playthrough set out as to what I want to do. But I didn't think it would take this long to go through the game. So yeah, now he's all ugly and he's got a flat nose. I mean, is that even a nose? So now he fires off a tri-beam. It's supposed to be tri-beams. And Goku's just going insane. 
well yeah he, he he just he just floats around he just shows up randomly to just do something that most of the other humans would just find impossible to do and so they're just basically pushing at each other and they're gonna get going and he finally jizzes out and there he is exactly so he goes and grabs Tian, goes and grabs Piccolo, who's gonna, who is knocked out without even being touched, despite the fact of becoming a super nanic. Just bull crap. Thank you, instant transmission. Well, can't you just try to work? Can't you just practice? Like, there. So yeah, Cell is now. Yeah, now one day has magically passed in the space of like eight minutes. Um, I guess we can just mess around for the next. I think I probably got maybe I can probably fit maybe two, maybe three or four more minutes in. Or I could just bloody end the segment right now, but I'd rather not try to use that. So Trunks gets his other gets his other blast uh, energy attack. So too does Vegeta. Trunks becomes all emo with the long hair. Pretty much. This is not training for the full year, even though it really only took him a couple of months to transform. Exactly. I'd rather keep it a secret. Clearly, clearly works. Else, what up, Android 17? Yeah, here we go. He's. He's all fucking smug and obnoxious and shit like that. It just annoys me. Tripled. Well, he did, well, he did more than triple his strength. Trust me. New set, a few new sets of armor. So, yeah. Actually, hang on a sec. Didn't. Oh no, no. She did. She did give. She did have, present the armor after they got now. Cause, yeah. No, Trunks had trained in that sort in that outfit when he was in there, but then he transferred, but then he went into the Saiyan battle armor after he got out. So Goku and Gohan are training in that Saiyan battle armor, which Gohan's going to be in for the rest of the game, even in the fight against Cell, which is clearly bull crap, because you know he was wearing the set, the silly of shit that Piccolo was wearing, because we all know about the clothes being Piccolo's most metro attack. And I'm just walking around for no apparent reason whatsoever. Alright. What do we got? We have to go down to... Ah, yes, I know where we go. We're going down here. Tropical Islands. Save stating. Uh, might as well save just for the hell of it. And guess what? It's now time for a Planet Zebeth reference. It's despite the fact that I've never seen it before. But, yeah. Alligators. Wah. Okay, there probably isn't going to be a Planet Zebeth reference, to be honest. Because these are alligators and not crocodiles. Or crocomires, for that matter. But, yeah. These things. They're, they're not that hard to kill. I do have to do some training here. Because I need to get them to 34. I need to get to 35, I believe, which is the barrier to get into the next area to fight Cell. Um, there's, there's still one new, there's one new enemy, or, or should I say one new class of enemy to show off. I mean, it's just an upgraded form of the pro enemy. I might just show that off and then call it quits for this whole recording. I mean, I'm at... I'm at I'm at a total of just over 42 minutes at the moment, and I didn't yield, and that, that that actually didn't yield any fish. And yeah, we now have the green class of ladybug. Don't know why they invented ladybugs. I mean, ladybugs are supposed to be peaceful creatures, and yet they are designed to kill things. No matter, no matter what I do. All right. Excuse me. Safe stating here and ending the segment at this point. So, next time we will 
continue our course to the tropical mountains and beat the shit out of Cell. So see you for that.